Hi, it's Ronnie, and welcome to Christy's Beautiful Life 30 Days of Sketches, round nine. And if you'd like to post a, your take on this sketch, use hashtag 30DSCBL9 on Instagram. And this is the sketch that I'll be using today, and I'll be mostly using it for inspiration. You will be able to tell in the end, if you're looking at both things, that I did use it, though. And the sketch was created by Shannon Allure. And it's super cute and simple, too. And y'all know I like a little more, so that's why mine's going to be a little different. I'm going to scrap two photos of Malachi. And the collection I'm using is Photo Play. And I believe it's called Little Boys Like Big Adventures. And I'm going to do some punch art here. I'm going to make a tractor similar just a wee bit <laughs> to the one that he is sitting on in the photos i used two gear collections both are tim holtz one is called gadget gears and then the other one oh, it's it's called gears something gears they might be gadget gears too i don't know but they're the little thin ones and there's like 28 maybe in the collection of gears so you get plenty to choose from i picked the two most solid ones to use here for my wheels now i know that one looks kind of funny for a wheel but i thought well you know if you were trying to get some traction and had rear wheel drive then it might do pretty good after all i'm doing some layering here the one in the photo has white and it has black in the middle I decided to go ahead and add some yellow, and so that one puffy sticker has a camera on it, and then the other flare there, it's got little polka dots. Punch I just used is Stampin' Up, and the other one down there is two, and I haven't used them in a long time, but one's a smaller one, and the other one's a larger one, and those two pieces there they're tabs from we are memory keepers and of course about that time i thought i haven't inked anything i wanted to ink some stuff so i pulled out lagoon from close to my heart and i'm just going to go around everything and give it just a little bit of ink and that one you know of course i had to pull back up to ink it so it looks kind of messy but in the end, by the time I get the tire and wheel thing on there, you don't notice it. I didn't make a sample, so I will be trimming here a little bit, trying to decide exactly how I wanted to do it. I knew I wanted to use that punch and cut a chunk out of there instead of just using the scissors. But I wasn't exactly sure how I needed to cut the other part. Kind of like a dash is what I'm thinking. And... The tab punch from We Are Memory Keepers, I used it as a seat, as you can tell. And I wanted that one to overlap the other just so you could, well, tell that it's a seat instead of just something sticking up there. I'm adding both the wheels now, and I'm putting them right along the edge of the desk, the tabletop thing, so that they're both the same distance from the table and go straight across and that i found that's my easiest way to do that this is a martha stewart punch and it's a dragonfly and i'm going to cut it apart to make my steering wheel and yeah <laughs> i'm going to put it in a complete different configuration and since i've got a banner that later i'm going to use and it says beep beep on it I wanted to go ahead and add a horn, so I decided to do it in yellow to match the wheels. So there's like three yellow things on my little tractor. And that is kind of a funny shaped and looking tractor. But the one in the photo is too. I am moving this over just a tiny bit farther probably than the one in the photo. And I decided to go ahead and add these geometric shape dies on there to give it some texture it is white and two different colors of mint and i'm just going to put this on top and add a little more white and add texture to it not a whole lot though it don't show up super good especially after i put the stars on there 
and the stars are going to take the place of the scallops along the edge of that paper and I'm not going to put them you know straight down and make them even like those scallops are and I do have several sizes so that was sure and not be even along there and I have several colors too I used red because he has red in his shirt and it's snuggle monster so cute and um, I am putting the, the, that color on there and then he has a dark blue shirt very dark blue navy and so I put the navy on there too and then I'm adding two colors that from the background paper the mint color I've got two there's two different mints there so I'm adding two colors similar to them and then some yellow too but while I am doing that I want to mention that down there below <laughs> is the links I mean a bunch of links down there Christy does a wonderful job on the 30 days of sketches and more and more people want to join every time and she is just so sweet that she don't want to leave anybody out so we have plenty down there and although everyone is not doing it every day there are some that are <laughs> I mean so lots of inspiration mostly because of everybody loving Christy and the sketches that she picked there is a Facebook group and you can go there and check them out. There is albums for each one of the hops and for each day there's a page, I guess you'd call it. And if you did the layout, you could post yours in that page. And the thing is, you can scroll down that page and that one sketch might have 30. And so with 30 days of sketches, loads and loads and nine rounds, an unlimited practically amount of inspiration down there down there in the Facebook group not down there down there there is too but I was talking about the Facebook book group that time but uh, my tractor looked kind of plain so I first thought about using some swirls and putting flames on there and then I thought no I think I'm going to put some stars there'll be that empty space there where the stars will be stopping and I'm just going to go ahead and put some stars. I am putting the banners on the um, sketch are coming out from the side. But I have one that says beep beep. Which I mentioned earlier because of the horn on the string wheel. So I have to have them come down from the top instead. And these are just from the cover sheet on the photo play. And I just cut the three strips off and I'm just using them. And the beep beep is what got me. I wanted that one on there. My photos are just everyday photos, which I love to scrap. And they're of Malachi. My son sent me the one on the right first, and I sent him a text back saying, Oh, wow, he looks like he's saying, I've got this. So that's going to be the title of my layout. And then he went LOL and sent me the other one. And he looks a little hesitant and worried about that one. So he's not at the point yet of I got this on it. But uh, he said that uh, he was better at it after his on it a few minutes. He said it didn't take him long, but he wasn't sure about it to start with. He does have riding toys. One is battery operated. And the other, you know, you just move your feet. This one, however, had pedals, so it did take him a minute to get it. Then I decided I needed a few more highlights on my tractor, so I'm adding them. And I didn't mention, I don't think I did anyway, <laughs> I don't know, uh, that the title is an Amy Tan uh, font uh, with thickers. And I'm not sure which collection they go with, but it's super cute, so I wanted to use it. And it has some as capitals and some not, like the eyes are not capitals. I did think about using an L instead and make them my own capital, but uh, I went with the flow and used what was actually made for the eye. Um, I think that's it. I think I add a few more stars. I did use my EK success punch for the smaller stars, which, you know, they have like this little locking device on the back. 
I went to pull it out and it wasn't on there. No telling where it's at. It was not on there when I pulled it out. So I'll have to be watching for that thing. So I can put it back on. I put it back on plenty of times. I just didn't notice it was gone this time. But uh, that's it. That's my layout. And little Malachi on the tractor looking so cute. We've had some really nice warm days. I mean, seriously, seriously, we had freezing rain three days that was on the trees. I mean, three days it didn't melt away until Saturday. Oh, maybe noon, one o'clock, you know, you could look out there and it wasn't there no more. Finally, Monday it was 77 degrees. That was Saturday, Monday 77 degrees. So yeah, we've had some weird weathers, but the kids has had plenty of time to go outside and play in between. And that's what Malachi did. But if you leave a comment down there below, I'll try to get back with you. And if you like the video and hit a thumbs up, I'd appreciate it so much. And if you are subscribed to my channel, I would love to have you subscribe. And those of you who are, thank you so much. But I hope you all have a happy scrappy week. Have fun on the hop. Get lots of inspiration. And try some of the sketches. Bye.